that's still going to be my intro. <laughs> Epi, what a great job. I felt very reminiscent of your Epi speech today. I was so excited last week. I even saw the president. I really thought she saw the president for real until she showed the picture and I was like, wait, that was a great job. The climax of that alone, I was just like, oh, she went to Washington. She had a great trip. It was, it was just really good. You, you built this up. You started with facts. You got into the facts of why you were, why, what the speech was about. And you gave us information as to the person that actually led you to see all the things that you got to experience at that, that location. <clears throat> that you, you had a great use of space, bending. At one point you were over here bending and then you were up here in the air. I thought your voice was really great, your voice reflection was really great. And at one point, you were using your hands a lot. And I noticed you, you thought about that. And you pulled it down. And you weren't just going like this the whole entire time. So that was great. I know last time you actually said that to someone about their speech. So it's like you were really cognizant of that. So that was really great, your hand movements. How you led us into the story from the beginning to the end when Madame Toussaint was born and how she traveled and what she learned and what actually led her to, to start it was, was awesome. And the best part to me was at the end when you said a fellow Toastmaster will actually make it into Madame Toussaint's. And I'm almost certain that would be me. So I'm just <laughs> <sorry>. <laughs> Just kidding. So overall, I believe that you really and truly, I don't have any anything negative to say. I think you did great. I've seen one or two of your speeches, and I've seen much improvement. And I think that you did great, and you can move forward to be in the competitions just like everyone else, and be great. <laughs>